Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Andrew Can, and together we can game. Here to bring you my brand new project, Far Cry 1 for the PC. Now, I've never actually played Far Cry before. This is my first interaction with the entire series, but I've seen a lot of things for Far Cry 3 and 4 that have got really interested, so I thought what better way than to play the original to understand where we've come thus far. That's why I'm proud to bring you Far Cry Blind. So, without much else to do, then let's get started. Let's go campaign, do medium. You'll be challenged, but adventure requires a little danger, right? Absolutely. Let's get started. So that was a really interesting cutscene. It seems that the guy in the red shirt is probably who we're going to be. Seems he was on the boat Medusa with a woman who abandoned ship when it looked like the military was going to blow it up. And then there were those, those demonic creatures. It's a really interesting start, I have to say. Now, that looks like a red Hawaiian shirt. Kind of reminds me of uh, the shirts they had in Hawaii Five O. But just looking at it, this is from early 2004. But this looks really good for that time period. I'm really impressed. Now, I don't know who we're playing as. It wasn't really described, but I think it's standard PC controls. WASD to move. Space. Controls to crouch. Shift is to run. Okay. Basic controls. So, I think we're either in Hawaii or some kind of tropical island like that. And there's dead bodies. There's a poster on the wall. Sick like of a flight pilot. So, interesting. Some more propaganda and stuff on the wall. Find a way out of here. And I think that was us. I think it was their character we were playing who said, I gotta find a way out of here, so let's do it. What does that say? That actually looks to be of an Asian language. Maybe we're in Japan. That makes sense. All right, we're gonna probably need to crouch, of course. And then jump. Oh, I see what they're doing. We got the crouch and then we have the jump and now we gotta combine them, great. Aha, how do I, how do I, oh. Or we're supposed, okay, I've been playing a lot of Half-Life, don't judge me. Oh, fee, <laughs> okay. So far, I've confused it with other control schemes, but you know, older game. But, wow, that actually looks really good for this game's age. Okay, this is going to be a fun game. Just look how beautiful that looks, even for the... God, I'm really excited to play this now. And, oh, oh, God. Well, I think my theory of being in Japan is right. So... Looks like this guy was probably a Japanese fighter or soldier. But, I guess this is a good place to ask. 
Is it? Have you ever played a Far Cry game? Is this your first instance into the series, or have you played others? Let me know in the comments below. I am curious. But, Listen, oh. dirtbag. Keep an eye out for some punk in a red Hawaiian shirt. If you see him, call me at once. Am I understood? Yes, yes, sir. I'm heading out. So the guy in the cowboy hat does not seem to be liked by his uh, cohort there. Oh, so E and Q will let us lean. But as I was saying, let me know. Is this your first Far Cry game? Or have you played one before and are just checking this out? I'm really curious. Hold, crouch, and move forward. Yeah. Notice the stealth meter, which is probably the thing near the compass. Press G to throw a rock. I think I saw something. Ah, I see. So he's distracted. Wondering what the rock came from. Makes sense. Now, do we have unlimited rocks, or... Is that a thing, or... Oh, God! Huh. Well, I guess we're not going that way. Okay, so... Use... What is the... Use... Enter? Uh... R... F. Oh, F. Okay, thank God. Hello? Are you there? Pick up the radio if you can hear this. I know you're there. I've been tracking you since you and Val arrived. Who are you? I'm the guy who's going to tell you how to survive. Call me Doyle. How do I know I can trust you? Well, for starters, how about the fact that I haven't turned you in? That radio has a bio-reader. Since I know you're there, I could have ratted you out already. Good point. Keep talking. Listen, you need to get out of there and quickly. I'll help you as much as possible, but you don't have much time. There's an exit that will lead to a small camp. Be careful as you go. This area is crawling with mercenaries. By the way, name's Jack Carver. Oh, we're Jack Carver. Finally a name for the character we've been playing as. So that guy's name is Doyle, and he's apparently been uh, watching Jack, and apparently the woman's name is Val? Valerie, most likely, since we got on the island. Pretty interesting, if I say so. My reports say you're in a red shirt. We are. Grab some body armor and cover it, or you'll be easily spotted. Makes sense, so I'm guessing this is our way. I'm not sure if we can trust his name is Doyle. So, yeah. Some good news. I'm picking you up much more strongly now. I suggest you search the huts for weapons and equipment. So we have guy doing crates and is that that enemy is straight up fishing. Stay low and avoid contact if possible. You don't really want to alert the guards. No, not really. I kind of find it funny how that enemy's fishing, and there's a helicopter. And we've reached the slaughterhouse. Can we pick up the fishing rod? No, but... Weapon. Oh. Oh, it makes sense. We're in a meat house. So maybe... We have to be stealthy. Take him out. Oh god, there goes Stealthy. Parrot. Parrot kind of ruined that idea. Headshot. Okay. So, apparently, we're going to have to worry about real world hazards too. So that's going to make things interesting. Because I wasn't expecting that parrot to go off, but it gave away my position. That's a really interesting mechanic. Can't say I've seen that in too many games. Oh god, new gun, thank god. But, um, yeah, I just wanted to say, this world is pretty interesting, looking at the fish, the islands, got a pretty good render distance. It's going to be an interesting title, but one of my favorite things, and I, I think this is a good point to bring up, of playing a game for the first time, is honestly, just exploring the world. Like, here, look at these boars. I'm going to free the boars! Be free, my pigs! RUN FREE! Or not. They... Are they following me? Okay, enough being the pig overlord, I should probably explore the huts for ammo like I was supposed to be doing. So I went in that one, and I haven't checked out this one. Can we use the radio? No. Well, there's some ammo in here. And what is... Play Merc? Oh my god, are, are you kidding me? Really? Play Merc. Girls, guns, and gas masks. Wow, I was not expecting to see that in this. Okay, 
Well, that just reached all new levels of interesting. <laughs> Let me know. Do you have a subscription to play, Merc? I am 100% curious. Actually, no. Please don't tell me if you have a subscription to that. I, I, no, oh, God. Anyway, is this the barracks I'm taking, I guess? Seems like just where they chill around and relax. Nothing in the garbage. Nope. Got some bananas, some health. And... Jack, I've been able to tie your oh. compass in with the transceiver. This means that now I can supply you with the bearings marker. It should give you a rough idea of where to go at least. X to Oh. Oh. So we can change if it's automatic or single shot. That's pretty cool. It's basically semi automatic or automatic. So that's gonna be useful. Hmm. So I guess from here, we make our way to the hut. Because that's where it's saying on the compass we need to go. So s someone's leaving. Use your binoculars to survey the surroundings. Notice that they have a sound enhancer and movement tracker. Dr. Krieger has fitted everyone on the island with locator signals that you can track using the binox. Dr. Krieger, he said. So, okay, so we can use the binoculars. How? Uh, H, J, A, oh, B, okay. <laughs> it's weird, because sometimes they tell us what needs to be done, and others they don't. Oh, it's him. All right, you lazy SOBs. Search every inch of this damn island. Let's figure out what the hell is going on here. When you figure it out, let me know, because I'm confused as hell. Are we after him or Dr. Krieger? Or is he Dr. Krieger? I don't know, really. What is that? Huh. That's cool. We can look at the wildlife in the binoculars, too. Wasn't really what I was trying to do, but... So we have a sniper. It's pretty interesting. And I like how we can swim. You should try to acquire one of their vehicles and drive to the helicopter refueling pad. It's on the other side of the island. From there, you can use one of their boats to escape. So we need to acquire a vehicle. So I'm going to kind of be stealthy because this game is... Well... Actually, I usually run a gun, but I feel like this game has a higher emphasis on if you're stealthy. I don't know I'm getting that feeling. But hopefully I'm right. So I'm going to crouch around. So they're mercenaries, not military. Big difference. Okay, so the U.S. government's not after us, but Dr. Krieger is, essentially? So I figure if we make it in through this hut... You seen the new guns they got over on Pagal? Seems like this would be the best thing to do. Let's take out that. Okay. I don't think they know where I am. They don't. Sweet! Okay, I'm just gonna keep sniping. The sad thing is, it's working. Really well, actually. Okay, well. Using the trees as my guys helped. You getting out the sniper. I think we're good. Alright, I think we're okay with the objective clear. Oh god! Okay. Kinda honestly could hear the footsteps. 
Why is the music getting like that? Departure 0800 supply base old fort Where are we? We are in Japan, are we? Actually, we may be in Hawaii because they're pretty close kind of Actually, I'm not very sure where we are. I think we're in Japan though Okay, just kind of exploring around here card key Those look like the creatures we saw earlier is that a note? Yeah, those were. I can't really read what it says, but... God, this is... It's getting really interesting. Use the door. So now I want to find out where this key goes to. I don't think it would be how we get into the vehicle. Well, I mean, it is a key. I feel like it'd be a little more sneak, sneaky than that. I feel like a, a card key doesn't really make much sense for a vehicle. But I've been wrong before. So we use the use button. Armory. That's probably where it's to. Where in here, I don't know yet. It's always a guard. Oh. What do you know? It wasn't a guard. Usually, though, I'm. Let me know. Or do don't you usually expect a guard in the armory, or is that just me? Am I a little bit paranoid here? But I always expect at least a guard or two in the armory. Just kind of makes sense to me. You know, I don't think that there's any other enemies left. Alright, I got that done. Jeez. I think they may be keeping Val in the old carrier refueling station. You're going to have to check it out up close, I'm afraid. A carrier? Yes. The Japanese Navy beached one of their light carriers on this island during World War II. Those mercenaries have refitted it into a helicopter refueling station. This whole deal gets stranger by the minute. You don't know the half of it. We don't know the half of it. So we need to go to a Japanese... Carrier? Okay, so we hit a... Hit that. So now we're going to... Oh god, oh god, oh god! I think that's... I think I did that right. Did I take him out? I did! Okay, okay, getting this one. I don't know, it just seemed like it was a smarter idea. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Who's shooting that man where? Oh, shit. Shit all. Next one. Generally, when there's enemies like that, you're going the right way, so I'm going to take this vehicle, too. I just kind of keep passing up, or keep passing along the videos. It's like, or videos. Vehicles, I feel like I'm playing vehicle tag. Oh god, hit him. Oh god, another ar another ar shoot. Another one? Two for Oh god, I should have watched where I was going. It's him, so they know who we are or that we're sought after. Okay, so we have vehicle health in the in the left there, so oh god, oh god, run. This is so hard to maneuver. Like, I'm really doing my best here. Oh god, oh god, oh! Oh, okay. Alright, Doyle, I've spotted the carrier. Now tell me, how do I get in? I've only been there once, but I remember there was a hole in the side. You should be able to get in there. I'm on my way. On the side, does it mean the giant hole, or... Are we gonna have to climb up, or... Hmm, we do still have the vehicle, but I feel like I feel like that is something we're going to have to figure out in the next episode. Let me know, what do you think of Far Cry 1 thus far if you've never played it? And if you have played it, what do you think of it as a game? I think it's a really interesting 
interesting game thus far, and I can't really wait to explore more into it. It's a beautiful looking game, and so far I've had a very good time. So let me know what you think, and I will see you in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching, thank you all so much for your time, and as always, I hope you have a great day. This archipelago is the ideal location for my research. These islands are isolated from international shipping lanes, so I am free to do my work without interference from the outside world. This work will take time, but a measure of the future of mankind depends on the success of my research here.